You talk a lot about ownership and giving the right people freedom to pursue these focuses. Tell us a little bit about why that's important. When you think about most big companies, or corporations, uh, people come in, they do their job, they punch the clock, and they go home. They don't feel yeah. that they are really very important in the scheme of things. They feel they're a cog in a wheel, and uh, which is very different from the environment that you have in a startup firm. Because in a startup firm, uh, it's like a, a, a CEO of a startup told me, he says, you can either be uh, on the Queen Elizabeth too, or you can be on a rubber dinghy. <laughs> so when you're on the rubber dinghy, every wave hits you. You, you, you feel yeah. it, right? But when you're on a giant you know, liner, you don't even know if the ship is uh, afloat or not, or is moving or not, because it's so, you're so isolated from the waves that are hitting the company. So in a startup, there's a much greater sense of ownership and involvement and engagement um, and what we feel is that that entrepreneurial spirit, that energy, that passion can actually be unlocked inside a big company. Mm -hmm. So there is, you know, you can have corporate innovators just like you can have uh, entrepreneurs. But what you need to do is in order to make them feel like owners, you have to give them rope. You have to give them resources. You have to give them freedom mm -hmm. to execute. And that's the idea of sort of what we call the blank checks, which is finding a few good people and then really betting on them by giving them practically infinite resources to do, pursue, you know, so we call it, you know, unimaginable goals mm -hmm. with unlimited resources and an impossibly short time frame. <sighs> so, so essentially you, you push, you say, all we're going to look at is the results and these are the things you sign up for, but, you know, pursue because mm -hmm. budgets and constraints really tie people up in knots yeah. and companies. So, but you can't do this with every employee in the company. You know, not everybody is cut out to be an entrepreneur. Right. So that's why we again say focus, you know, find the 10% or the 5% of the people who are really sort of the entrepreneurs that are, that are hidden inside your company, bet on them, give them the freedom, give them the resources, and you can create that sense of ownership and passion. And you know, so this is what we call like unlocking the potential of the people that mm -hmm. work for you because uh, you know, I remember uh, a, an employee at Ford who said uh, he was worked on the assembly line. He says, for 25 years, I gave you my, my hands. But if you had asked for my mind and my heart, I would have given it to you. Oh, wow. That's so we're not, using, we're not using the true potential mm. of people in large companies. So that's the idea of blank checks is to really sort of find a few people, empower them, give them the resources, and then measure the results. Keep a tight leash on the results, but, that, but not measure the process. Mm. That's the idea.